F it. Give me CMC read option with Debo Samuel. He could be a oh good quarterback. I think Christian McCaffrey is the best weapon in the NFL. Christian McCaffrey was proving yesterday that he might be the best running back in football. You can, you can either say that Christian McCaffrey is the best running back in football, but I want to go like a little bit of a different step and say that Christian McCaffrey is the best weapon in the NFL. Yeah. Maybe yeah. not the best player, but the best weapon. Well, we like, haven't you seen can Michael use him Parsons so many in ways. the backfield. If we saw Michael Parsons. Uh, Michael, if Michael Parsons put that boy, offense, Put that boy oh in the fullback. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> he he, 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 he would be a disgusting tight end. Yeah, like, he would. Bro, he would be end, good at anything, but like, he's back. built like a tight end. He's just like, how tall is he, 6'6"? Six, six? Like, no, he's 6'3". Six, six, like six, Christian three, McCaffrey? One. No Christian, way. Michael Parsons only 6'1"? So is he actually only 6'1"? Yeah. Probably. That is insane. I thought he was taller. He just looks bigger. Linebackers aren't, aren't tall like that, I know, that, but he plays so fucking big. That's yeah. insane He just looks big on the field. When he's running anyway. yesterday into the end zone? Okay, sorry. We I didn't want to mean talk to bring this back to the Cowboys. Why are we talking Yeah, agree. No, he's 6'3". Michael Parsons is 6'3". That's pretty good size. Yeah, it's But he built... He's a big boy. He's built like Thomas the Train or something. Yeah. He's fucking huge. I'll agree with you, though, on that. Like, Christian McCaffrey... Like, I don't... At least there's not like many weapons that comes my, to mind when I'm like thinking like what do I want in someone that can be a just a Who, multi-faceted like, just player. an absolute game breaker, game changing. Tyreek like, Hill is like, one. We just Tyree, yeah, he's yeah. one. Debo is one too because of the Debo way you can use one. him. And Dan on the same team. That's yeah, crazy. No, that's Christian McCaffrey is just like you. I look, who who'd you say backed up? Who's backing up Jimmy Garoppolo? Uh, Brock right Purdy? now, Big Cock Brock Purdy. Big yeah. Cock Brock Purdy, like. Rock Let's Purdy. put Christian McCaffrey back there. If if Yo, your team that was goes a down. dot. That it was, was a dot. Dime. Right, uh, right in the bread basket. Nice. Like, oh, my oh, oh my lord! Oh my lord! It's like 30, 30. 35. I think. You got Lamar yeah. Jackson, dual threat. Jalen Hurts, little read option. F it. Give me CMC read option with Debo Samuel. He could be a oh good quarterback, my. probably. I, I kind of agree with you. I think Christian McCaffrey is the best weapon in the NFL. I think that's I'm I'm so pumped to see because it sucks because like the Niners did what they did yesterday without Debo Samuel, which is yeah. crazy to me. So imagine once those two are on the same team, like because it's really obvious that McCaffrey already knows the playbook pretty well and they have a bunch of packages for him. Once they get the Debo slash Yuschek slash McCaffrey slash Kittle, Ayuk, that whole – oh, my God. You want to know what I think is also crazy about that Christian McCaffrey? Package. Like yesterday, and I think it goes to why he's the best weapon in the NFL. He outscored Derek Carr yesterday. As Not a thrower? That, as, a, as, as a thrower. A, yeah. Okay, let me rephrase. As a passer, he outscored Derek Carr. Not that hard to do with the way the Raiders are playing, but still incredibly yeah, impressive. Sure, sure. As a rusher – he outproduced Jonathan Taylor, mm, who many good. have said is better than CMC. And Went above I'll him in every Fal fantasy draft. I'll give Felipe every credit, who has said CMC is still the best running back and has consistently been on that. That's and then true. as a receiver, Christian McCaffrey outscored Justin Jefferson. So I want to ask another question. If Christian McCaffrey was not a running back and was just a wide receiver, where would he rank amongst the best wide receivers in the NFL right now? That's hard to say because he catches passes a lot of time from the backfield. Yeah. But he, I mean, dude, he's so and shifty if you put him in the slot to run routes yeah not nah, forget forget the swing routes and the screen passes and so the stuff that's designed play. for him to get in space him as a route runner would be a top 10 player like he'd be a top 10 receiver i, I don't i don't the even way, the way have he any moves questions about and that. cuts and everything and oh my you saw him go up and get that ball in the end zone oh too yesterday my. like what i always remember is that one game the the panthers were playing the jaguars probably the ugliest matchup ever the way you say jaguars <laughs> yeah, yeah it's like he's not alone it's probably saying that by it's probably how we say it in texas you know shout out yeah, texas I, like, i've heard lots of people say that especially it's like J A G wires the panthers were playing the jaguar jaguars jaguars, jaguars. <laughs> the jaggies yeah there you go. And, jags the jags and christian Shit. mccaffrey moved out to the slot and they put miles jack miles jack who used to be a running back at, at ucla yeah. play linebackers so one of the most athletic linebackers in the league on him and he just hit him with the little uh a little slant but first like a little outbreak and then kept cutting back in and left uh miles jack in the dust and it just showed you how elusive and just how good of a route runner he is how quick out of his breaks he is how bursty he is and it was just like that showed me i mean that, that dude could be a receiver right now because like what we see that all the time with justin jefferson and it's like you get those like high school coaches on twitter like oh this is how you should run a route <laughs> christian mccaffrey does that every single time he steps at receiver so i want crazy. them to start using him like they use debo obviously debo's listed at receiver they use him as yeah. a running back but they should start doing the same thing with christian mccaffrey lining him up as a running back I'm, and then i, I guarantee and you then use him as a receiver I, was more like, I guarantee you they do end up doing that because the 49ers more than any other team run a ton of motions and trying to confuse the defense so i guarantee you see some weird motion yeah. where you get debo coming to the backfield and then chris mccaffrey splits out wide just like just really with so that. here's a here's what else Wait, i'm thinking I got, about I, the, I found something also on that 
Every I'm time what, you try to change the subject, Adam's like, oh, Adam's always chiming in here. Well, <laughs> I just <laughs> looked up. Speak. I just I wanted to look up receiving grades for this year. Um, and Christian McCaffrey, if you just looked at him as a receiver on PFF, mm. would currently be a top five wide receiver. In terms oh, of, damn. In Are terms you of, serious? In terms of wide receiver grades. Now, it's tough because it's, it's, he's less ra- the route tree's a little bit smaller. Obviously, like yeah. you said, he's coming out of the backfield. But if we're just looking at pure receiving grades, Christian McCaffrey's a top five Wait, who's, wide receiver right now. Who's above him? You got – You're going to have like Valus Jones or something. Actually, actually, excuse me. He's four at a- AJ Brown's eighty four point four, and Christian McCaffrey was. I gotta hit the back button, but I believe it was eighty four point five. Cooper Cup, Tyree Kill, and Stefan Diggs. Okay, wow, that's company yeah. right there. So the, that's a so legit Christian McCaffrey grade, is in the in the top. It's five not, that's not some niche category. Then it's like the elite. That's okay. So it's safe to say, if Christian McCaffrey played wide receiver, he'd be a top five receiver. Correct. Yeah, and that's damn. crazy. <laughs> And that is Felipe why Felipe said top ten. Felipe said top ten. And that is why the, numbers the 49ers, are- check it off, Ben, are the biggest Super Bowl contenders in the NFC. I think they are Adam they should be the NFC. The That's absolutely dumb to say that when you nope. have a team that literally hasn't lost in twenty twenty two. Do you think CMC is the best weapon in football right now? I know I for sure do. So hey, don't forget to like, subscribe, follow us on all of our social platforms. We'll see you next time.